الحمد لله والصلاة والسلام على نبينا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه وسلم أما بعد حبيبي في الله as a reminder of the importance of du'a in, in making a change in our lives and having an effect upon our lives uh, and that we should never despair because Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala sees and hears everything and he is aware of everything and he can make a change in your life whatever you need whatever stress whatever you're dealing with Allah Azza wa Jal the Most High whom we worship alone uh, can he can hear and affect your lives and make the make the make your lives more uh, more livable and more bring benefit to your life subhanahu Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says Kitab al Karim وَقَالَ رَبُّكُمْ ادْعُونِي أَسْتَجِبْ لَكُمْ إِنَّ الَّذِينَ يَسْتَغْفِرُونَ عَنْ عِبَادَتِي سَيَدْخُلُونَ جَهَنَّمَ دَاخِرِينَ Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says in Kitab al-Kareem and supplicate to your Lord. So Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has commanded us to supplicate to Him. And He will answer you. Allahu Akbar. And then Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, إِنَّ الَّذِينَ يَسْتَغْفِرُونَ عَنْ عِبَادَتِهِ And verily those who are arrogant uh, with regards to uh, uh, you know, worship, then they will, they will be in the hellfire, uh, you know, forever. So here Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has commanded us to supplicate to him, and he has promised us to Baraka wa ta'ala that he will answer us, and that the one who fails to supplicate and f fails to remember that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will answer their supplications and assist them and help them and he should be relied upon subhanahu wa ta'ala those people who fail to do that that this is a form of arrogance and then there are those people who disbelieve totally in Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and never supplicate to him because they don't believe Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says we could have al kareem وَإِذَا سَأَلَكَ عِبَادِي عَنِّي فَإِنِّي قَرِيبٌ مُجِيبُ دَعْوَةَ الدَّاعِ إِلَى إِذَا دَعَانٌ فَلْيَسْتَجِيبُوا لِي وَلِيُؤْمِنُوا بِي لَعَلَّهُمْ يَرْشُدُونَ And if they ask you, uh, and if my slaves, they, and if my slaves ask, <laughs> Uh, if my slaves ask you about me, then verily I am close. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is close to us, subhanahu wa ta'ala. Closer to you than your juggler made. He, subhanahu wa ta'ala, knows every, knows our condition. Uh, for verily he is qareeb. And he answers the supplication of the one who supplicates if he supplicates. And so answer this call, this call to supplicate Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And believe in him in order that you will receive guidance. Your shadun. La'alhum your shadun in order that they will receive this guidance, this rushd. So again, this is the importance of supplicating to Allah, to answer the call of your Lord subhanahu wa ta'ala and realize that he subhanahu wa ta'ala will answer your supplication. The Prophet sallallahu said that dua huwa ibadah, that supplication is worship. So all of this encourages us makes it so that we should not despair and know that your Lord subhanahu wa ta'ala can, can give you anything you need and anything you want. So supplicate to him and him alone. And that's the reward of Tawheed. Wa sallallahu wa sallam ala Muhammad.